So currently I've been interested in seeing what kinds of metals are strongest and like how they perform against bullets, obviously. But we just got done shooting the titanium, super awesome. I also have a thick piece of aluminum. So this is a much softer, much more lightweight metal. So it's gonna be interesting to see how well it performs. Let's find out. First gun, first bullet is the 22 long rifle. The 22 long rifle against the titanium and the steel have done absolutely nothing. My guess for the aluminum is that we might see a little bit of an indentation just because of how soft the metal is. He hit on the corner, so we're gonna take one more shot. Got it, let's go check. So it was right next to your shot. <laughs> Missed the corner though, but it did damage. It's gonna be hard to see on camera for you guys. The aluminum has these grooves in it. It pretty much just flattened out those grooves, maybe a little bit more. It's honestly gonna be interesting to see how far up the scale of guns we get. We might not even make it to the 50. All right, nine millimeter full metal jackets. We're a little bit up close and personal, but here we go. I feel like it's the exact same like size dent as the 22. Got some of the jacket on there, but honestly not that big of a dent. Yeah, I'd say about the same size dent as the 22 long rifle. Which means that we gotta move on to some rifles and the first rifle on the chopping block, not the chopping block, the first rifle up, the AR-15, 223. 223 full metal jacket. Super fast, very small projectiles. It's gonna do some damage to this thing. That's my prediction right now. Did I hit the corner again? Probably. Oh my gosh. It's been a very unlucky day for hitting the corners of targets. I think I hit a corner. <laughs> nope, nope, I got it. Okay. Boom, baby. That is so cool. Look, like it's no longer smooth right there. Dang, completely bulged and a very very good size hole like I'll get in the Sun so maybe you can see it okay here is the official measurement it went in that much into the aluminum 762 by 39 if any of these bullets go through the aluminum that's where we're gonna stop hopefully none of them go through until we get to the 50 cal so that we can shoot the 50 We've agreed that if we hit another corner, we're just gonna move on. Nope, right there. Stop. Right there is where he hit it. That is a solid hit. Looks like it went about the same depth as the 223. Where's my stick? The stick test. That much. So, pretty good, honestly. Not bad, which leaves us room for other guns. We're moving on to the 308 next. Honestly, this aluminum is holding up way better than I thought. I'm kind of doubting if it'll go all the way through after seeing those other bullets, but who knows? Let's find out. Oh yeah, that did some serious damage on it. That is the deepest, the deepest hole so far. It's tearing this aluminum apart. Where's my stick? That much is how far it went in there. So that is, honestly, that's almost all the way through. We're pretty close. The 50 BMG, we should be able to go all the way through this. If he can center this shot in the very center of the aluminum, my prediction is that it just rips it apart and we have not one target left, but many, if that makes sense. Yep, you missed. Not a single shot on there. We gotta go again. Oh, oh no, <laughs> what the freak? I was looking at the wrong side. What in the world just happened? I was look I forgot we flipped it. Feel the metal, feel the whole thing, the edges and stuff. Yeah. It's warm. How did it come out sideways? Tell me how that happened. How did that happen? <laughs> How? How is this possible? <laughs> Did you hit the ground and it like bounced and? No, cause there was no dust. How is this possible people? <laughs> the bullet just literally hit sideways. It I know, I thought, I thought you missed it. <laughs> yeah, and then see. I see this huge thing on the back. Well, I don't care, it's freaking cool. Yeah. Like it looks sweet, yeah. literally. My whole thumb is in there. So we're just gonna leave it at that. We're not gonna take another shot because this is the coolest thing ever and we probably won't be able to replicate it. So we're just gonna end it. We're gonna end it at that, guys. This was an awesome video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys next time.